US 30 this week has not moved too much. What we can see, the price was bouncing between these two price levels around this supply zone, also very important levels for the price. The price could not make a breakout to the upside and also could not make a breakout to the downside. So everything still open on the on the daily time frame. On the weekly time frame, we can see that the price was jumping back and up and down, up and down, and also could not make a breakout to, from here, from this area between 37,400 and also above, which is 37,700. On the monthly time frame, we can see that the price has reached almost here to 38,000, which is a supply zone. And also from here, the price is making some kind of a movement. So everything is still open. There is also a possibility that the price returns back down all the way to 36,400 and confirm this bullish breakout as a valid one, which always I am expecting to see after the price has made a breakout. So it can happen that the price returns back down and then going back up this month, which we have three more weeks until this month ends. So everything's still open. So for that, we should also wait until the price makes a movement. On the weekly time frame, we can see that the very important level is this one here, around 37,300. If the price closes below on this weekly time frame, there is open space for the price to reach this one, which is 36,400, which I have mentioned. The monthly time frame will be a confirmation of this bullish breakout. If the price stays above, this will be a great signal for the bulls. If the price goes above, which means above 37,700, this will mean on the weekly time frame as some kind of a bullish breakout and also going to reach 38,000 as all time high for the price. So if that happens, we will see will it be or not. And for that, we need to see a daily time frame. Very important level, we can see that the price needs to break is 37,752 currently on the daily time frame for the bulls in order to reach 38,000. On the low side, if the price breaks below, which means below 37,400, this will mean that the price will try to reach lower side and that means around 37,200. And also if the price goes below this one, which means below 37,000, the price will try to reach this one 36,600. So we will see what happens each day because we can see that the price is dropping between these two price levels and the breakout can happen in any direction. But for now, I will check it also each day and I will also uh, make the analysis if the breakout happens and also what would be possible targets after the breakout happens. And for that, I will I will also share that each day inside the trade community where, the, where you can also join if you would like. The link will be below in the description. So feel free to check it. That's all for now and see you next time and happy trading. That is all from today analysis. I hope you enjoyed. If you have any question, feel free to leave a comment. If you like the analysis, click the like button and subscribe. See you next time and a happy trading.